Hey Virgos, welcome and welcome back to the channel. Hope all is well. So today I'm going to be doing a reading for you guys. Sun, moon, Venus, rising, north, no. Come on in, take what resonates, leave the rest. Okay. Let's see. What's the messages today? For Virgo, Holy Spirit, Divine Angels. Subscribe, like, share if you haven't already. Can I get one more? One more for Virgo. Somebody here is ready to show their true feelings that may have had outdated thinking. I feel like there's something that kind of can't escape this person. You might find out what they want to say to you or you to them. This could be anybody. Somebody here wants an outcome that brings in happiness. Okay. Let's see. What's the mask here? What's the mask? What's this mask in reverse? Somebody's really worried about how something is going to play out. But there's something positive that's coming in pertaining to a home or the completion of a cycle where somebody gets justice. Somebody's worried how you will take something if you know the details of a home dynamic or situation where it could potentially bring something to an end, okay? But things are going to be made fair by the way of just justice energy. Somebody's just uh, concerned about how it could affect the connection between you and them. Because somebody definitely wants to take it um, a level higher with you. The number four and five could be significant. What's this dragon? The dragonfly, what are you going to find out? Two of Wands. This could be about somebody that's at a distance from you. Somebody here could want to get away from a person that tried to kill them. Okay? Somebody's trying to fight somebody off to get to this abundant energy. Somebody here is fighting to get their money that somebody has taken. Somebody said they're not leaving without their money. Okay? Somebody's trying to tell them that, like, look, I got your money. I just need some time to get it. But somebody want that money right now. And a person could be holding that back. They have other alternatives or plans in order to clean this money that's not theirs here. Somebody has no intentions on giving this person their money back. Let's see. Or vice versa. Somebody's in a pickle when it comes to their guap. Somebody's not seeing eye to eye with you or you're not seeing eye to eye with them. Or this could be a person external to you and their third party. Wow. Tell me more about Virgo. Okay, somebody needs to close up some sort of like deal or investment because somebody's trying to make it look like an accident. Something look like an accident here. Something could occur at a particular location. I got this for the Cancerian uh, or water sign energy. Cancer Scorpio Pisces reading. So maybe that's something that you need to go and uh, 
to look up, but there's something that's going to go terribly wrong. There's some sort of investment that you might not need to make, okay? Because there's a group of people that's trying to collect off of something that they are making it seem like you're going to earn something from it, but rather there are a group of people that already have their names on something. Yeah, somebody wants you to go through some sort of loss. Okay, somebody could be losing their job. Okay. For some of you, you will be gaining some sort of gift or promotion. Yep, everything's going to be okay, though. Can I get two more cards for Virgo? Thank you, Holy Spirit. Okay, so we have trap. Somebody here was trying to trap a person. Okay, this could be a boss. This is somebody that um, uses supernatural uh, tactics or energies to keep people isolated. Hmm. The number is 31, 40, 78, and 4 could be significant. You are guided and divinely protected. No sort of like spell work is going to work here, okay? And you could be somebody that's into like um, channeling energies through cards or watching tarot. There's somebody here that's trying to take something from you or your child. There is a child or a feminine energy that could be sick here. Somebody's afraid of a person being sick for whatever this is that a person is trying to bring into the home to make somebody sick. Yeah, somebody had a dream about a person entering their home in dark clothing to take something, but leaving whatever this is behind to uh, make somebody sick here. This could even be like a landlord or something. This is the energy that it's given me. Okay, this could be fumes, this could be um, whatever this is. Somebody may have broke their promise to be there for a person that may be possibly pregnant here. I'm going to go ahead and do a read. What's the message? The number is 75, 35, 59, 28, and 21. Could be significant to you. Queen of Cups and the, the Lovers. Okay, so there's a woman. There's a woman, right? She's worried that her person may leave her or that she may have to like be super emotional to manipulate an energy from uh, leaving her. But this person, if they're going to do this, they're going to go ahead with their gut and their instinct. They're not going to tell this person that they're going to break up with them. They're just going to do it. And somebody has no option but to like really bite down on the bullet and deal with it tell me more about this lover and the queen of cups somebody's going to be heartbroken that a other person came between this relationship this is a soul tie connection that might have broken up a relationship or that somebody allowed a soul tie connection to uh, break up a divine relationship here. We have the emperor in reverse. So this is an emperor that abuses his authority to gain whatever it is that he wants. I'm hearing that somebody met a person and fell in love with them right off the bat. And now maybe bringing a new life into this world. Somebody didn't imagine this happening or planning it, but this happened. 
there's some sort of gossip that's going around about what somebody's doing in their spare time. Somebody's a juggler. Somebody is juggling another person while they're in a relationship or having somebody else pregnant. Okay. This person could have like heavy water sign in their chart. Or this could be two different Cancerians. I feel like there was some sort of like relationship, dual relationship where a masculine and Aries may have been in love with a person but also in a relationship with somebody that they seem more to be a a long-term woman okay the love was almost like equal but on two different levels if that makes any sense okay so there's some sort of conflict or relationship problems, you know, problems with like making a decision. So there was some sort of stir up in the energy for a Sagittarius or a water sign here. There's a third party that's that's becoming a problem. I feel like somebody had to make a conscious decision to go from within to make their their exit out of a person's life because things got really sticky. Okay. Somebody started asking too many questions or once somebody confessed about what's really going on, it's like, yeah, there were lies exposed or they exposed themselves to, to kind of free their burdens. Maybe if I go ahead and tell one of the, the women or one of the men what's going on, maybe I can just kind of wiggle my way out of this relationship before it gets really, really hectic so that I can be with the other person but that just causes a lot more problems or issues somebody somebody is dealing with a queen of swords this could be an older woman or somebody that is just really don't play with it don't play with it type of person Somebody here that's dealing with this Queen of Swords can't can't do the same shit that they can. But somebody feels like the quick fix is apologizing and making it up to that person. And maybe that's the way that this person works, but not with you. There's a tower that's coming in here. There's a woman that doesn't know her worth, that accepts the man to come into her life and turn her world upside down only to have options and then make peace with it by doing things to make up for that time that a person was upset about the secret coming out. Somebody doesn't feel like they have to be this person's equal to give them any uh, structure or answers. All they're gonna keep doing is I apologize, I'm sorry, let me make it up to you. And they're going to keep doing the same thing over and over and over again. Virgo, when is enough enough? When are we going to hold people accountable? When are we going to stop these people from holding things over our head and not allowing them to be crucified because of what they've done to us? Because I'm pretty sure if the shoe was on the other foot, they would leave us in a heartbeat. So why can't we do the same for them? We need to hold them to the same standard that they would hold us to. That's just what it is. You're going to always be looking over your shoulder to wonder if this if this person has really changed. First position, and it's a time to act here. Look, there's wealth that's, that's showing up for you, but you need to get out of a situation. Okay, look, there's a lot of coins and wealth going on. Money is coming to you here. Okay. Tell me more about this Virgo energy. We have wishbone. So there's a wish that, that will not be granted. Okay. Do not be tempted to lower your standards for a person that wants or expects something from you. There's going to be news that will make you happy that's coming in. Someone, 
is going out of your life or there's an end of a situation that may be at a distance from you that's thinking of you okay let's see why this uh broken wishbone is here with this mask in reverse somebody is going to be revealed as the snake that they are you're going to you know press play on your life and starting over fresh okay because you were dealing with somebody that manipulated you with their emotions to get what they want from you to bleed you dry okay they're about to get their judgment Let's see. I'm going to get one more card for Virgo. We have Barrel. So you feel something is lacking in your life, perhaps love, money, or goals. There is a pleasure with a close friend that could also be a rat. They feel like if they're getting closer to you, that you'll share the wealth or some sort of spiritual insight with them. This is the same person that you need to stay away from because they're not sincere okay people are gonna let you down all the time but it's what you allow <clears throat> and that's what I'm saying holding people accountable and not letting anybody come into your energy to use you okay and use you for the wrong reasons not that they're adding to anything what's this barrel energy seven of swords means that whatever it is that this person is lying stealing or manipulating you about it's like you're gonna have the strength to let them go after this here this could be an air sign this could be two individuals gemini libra aquarius this could be a female as well or somebody that has air sign in their chart and what I would say is take somebody's um, word for something with a grain of salt. Just because somebody gives, feeds you some information does not mean, okay? You're a one-woman uh, show or one-man show, whatever this is here. Somebody is angry and bitter that they've been lied to. And that you could have been the other person. Somebody would have been okay with something if they had just been put up on game about it. Now somebody's at a crossroads on what to do, whether they uh, renew this energy or do they close it out. Yes, but somebody doesn't trust the person or it's like spiritually somebody has broken away from an individual or there's a lack of faith in something. Somebody's not connecting with a per person religiously, spiritually. Somebody's like really watching a person show their true colors and things unfolding. Somebody has a lot of toxic things that they indulge in. And it's sleeping around, lying. Okay. Let's see here. What's the message? What is it that we need to know for Virgo, please? Okay, so we have hood love. So somebody has the Midas touch. There's something about your community that's going to allow your, uh, your fruitful energy to thrive. Okay, we have sex magic creation partnered in reverse. So there's a disconnection between partnering up with somebody. Something is not coming together. Well, you're not coming together with somebody because you already know what it takes to get to this, this um, energy of Midas, okay? Everything you touch turns to gold. You don't need somebody to uh, coexist with you to have this happen. But you will use what you have in the community to attain this. Okay, it's always been in your DNA. You're already tapped into your higher self or your higher being. Let's 
let's see. Message for Virgo. Somebody's trying to prove the, their worth to the wrong people that don't even care about what's going on with them. Okay? Somebody's trying to convince people that they in what they believe in, but they're just talking shit. We call those filler conversations to sound important. Somebody's issues are making you feel stuck and unable to move forward. This is a karmic situation. Somebody is a sucker that falls for people's blatant lies and all of their secrets are going to be unraveling. Okay? Somebody's going to make it seem like it's your fault or you are the reason why they can't get up in life when you're not even in their lives here. You separated yourself already, but because of this failure or them taking the wrong route and damaging their own relationship, their own friendships or anything around them, they want to make it your fault. They want somebody to blame. Don't let them be the reason that they choose you to blame. So it's not their fault. Everybody's entitled to their opinion, but it's not for you to take on. They want somebody to blame. Don't let that person be you. Because it's going to consume your energy and then you're going to be stuck. Okay? Somebody's cock blocking. Why? Because they're jealous and envious that they can't have what you have. And that everything that they're made up of or the things that they showed you will soon be revealed to the not only the world, but you as well. Yeah, somebody is very hypocritical. Okay? Somebody hides the fact that they have an anger problem. And they're mad that you're unbothered. Okay. Let's see what these secrets are. What are these buried secrets that they don't want people to know? just sleeps around for the heck of it somebody does things that they normally wouldn't somebody has a sexual appetite or craving but it's gonna lead them to a lot of other issues here somebody's gonna sleep around and sleep around and sleep around and end up with some sort of like disease that they can't get rid of or that they have to take medication for for the rest of their lives and then come across a person that they love, but they can't give themselves wholeheartedly to this person because of this um, this sexual addiction, okay? I heard distorted. Somebody's um, voice or something could be distorted in their memory. We have the two of pentacles. Yeah, something is blurry for a person. Somebody's seeing doubles of something or seeing things that are not there. Some Somebody feels like, you know, they're being played tricks on. Somebody's going to be frustrated because their, their true self is coming up to the surface. And the fact of the matter is they didn't take their, the accountability to be with somebody yet such as this empress but rather slept around and been with with people that they don't really care about so it was a lose lose for this person or whoever this is pertaining to somebody didn't listen to their their uh higher self or go in the path of their higher self to reach their divine counterpart so you and this person could be connecting on a third dimensional level Somebody's going to have to have a front row seat at your level of success here. That could have been them and you, but they chose other things. Okay? And now you got to protect yourself. Because you don't want to be left disappointed and broken like they, they had you. When they chose that other life, you want a great tower. Even if that means you can't be with somebody here. You could have failed yourself in the past when it came to relationships, but now you're looking for, you know, consistency, positive consistency in your life. 
So even if you're guarded, that's something that you should do is guard yourself, guard your heart. Okay. Message for Virgo. So there's a deadline that you might have to meet or something that you need to hand in or whatever this is. I feel like if you work from home, there's some sort of deadline that you have to meet to continue this growth pattern that you're on. Yeah, we have new assets. Somebody here might go from needing a job to working from home, okay? You will have insurance here or need insurance. Somebody's climbing into this money tree energy. Somebody's competing for this. Somebody may be going from unemployment to working from home and gaining assets. Whatever it is that you do for work, it's like you're on a time schedule. Okay. There's positive spiritual alignment here, but there's also some spiritual warfare and some paranormal activity. So there are children outside of a marriage that a person could be holding off on telling their person, okay? There's something about a pet peeve of yours or the person external to you. You can't stand a particular person it's like they bring out all the things that you don't want to see or be. Okay, somebody could be the black sheep of a family. There could be an unpaid bill of some sort. Somebody could be gifted spiritually or academically. Okay, so we have karmic praise on the DM's weakness to allow a person to stay stuck. Somebody was caught texting the homie or a number in your contacts. Okay, it could be pertaining to a child. Okay, somebody could be finding the code to unlock your phone or their phone. This person's name could be Tessa, Palmer, Eugene, Juliana, Axel, Ezekiel, Arnold, Santino, Webb, and Eliano. Within the next few weeks, somebody's going to graduate. There's going to be some sort of graduation for a person to move up the, the chain of command in this occultic group. Yeah, there's a Cancer Scorpio Pisces that may act like they don't know what's going on, but they do know. They're having second thoughts about clearing their energy, but rather getting what they want here. Somebody is um, having second thoughts about something that they're a part of or initiated into whatever this is here. Okay, so there's a family group that believe that they paved the way for your success, so they feel like they have entitlement to it, okay? But somebody hasn't been very loyal, okay? And I feel like you have a level of confidence that somebody can't mess with you. Somebody has a very high IQ. Okay. Message for Virgo. Okay, so we have a mentor. 
somebody isn't allowing a student to move on to the role of a master. They're trying to impart false instructions for a person to move in the wrong direction. Somebody's trying to steer a person into the wrong direction, but there is going to be some sort of balance or um, divine justice that, that interrupts what this person is trying to do to keep you back on the track that you're supposed to align yourself with, okay? Somebody is falsifying information about you or you are about them, okay? Since we have three, I'm going to get one more. Okay, so we have gossip. Advocate and servant. Somebody feels like they can dictate to you what they want you to do. To play on your your innocence or whatever this is. This could be somebody that's an engineer. Here. Message for Virgo, please. Somebody is deleting files that they got on you, or vice versa. Somebody is deleting any sort of file that's pertaining to a person so that they don't get caught or they don't look like they've been involved. Somebody's been hired to watch, stalk you, and cause bodily harm, but they don't want any evidence left behind. Somebody's digging into your past life or um, you, your support systems or who you have in place. Somebody feels like you're getting help to gain abundance, prosperity, and power, like as if you can't get it by yourself. So somebody's trying to set you up with a opportunity to block you as somebody that's coming up as the student to be your own boss, your own teacher, your own something. Somebody doesn't want you to be led in the right direction, okay? Because that leads to the abundance that's showing up, 888. We are starting a family, okay? Somebody started a family with a side piece, okay? Somebody's going to get bail, by destroying property or because of them destroying property. Somebody is legally responsible for what a person does outside the walls of a prison here. Okay. Somebody here will never take accountability for giving a person an STD. This is what I'm saying. Somebody's acting like you're the one that gave it to them, but it's actually the other way around. What's the message? Spirit is telling you not to take BS from anybody. Somebody could be armed and dangerous and has goons lined up for when they need to. Somebody is financially going to use or abuse you, asking for money here. This is a materialistic person. So for somebody to be materialistic and not have anything to their name, but to be asking you to abuse you, it's like, that's crazy. Somebody that may have had a fostered upbringing could be the secret person that likes you. 
we have winter. So somebody could be carrying a firearm of some sort. Somebody is a recovering drug addict. Hmm. Message for Virgo. Okay, so somebody doesn't really like a person because they were told that a person had stole before. They have a background in theft, armed robbery, uh, breaking in and entering, theft of vehicles or whatever this is here. Okay, so there is a mature woman that is going to find some sort of change by way of a gift being granted to them here. Somebody's going to walk away from any life that goes beyond, goes under poverty. Somebody's going to have like a upgraded lifestyle very soon. Somebody's no longer going to have to deal with having to need anything or ask for anything. They're going to have everything that they need. Somebody's working hard to get out of a marriage because the person is very immature, irresponsible, and just expects things from this person. There's an unexpected income of sudden wealth that's coming in for you. But somebody's in their head about like travel or whatever is coming in, which is this money. Okay, so somebody could be delivering this check to you or wiring some sort of money to you that clears the pathway to start this new life or this new journey or whatever this is here. together that's like a big step for somebody but somebody misses you here somebody is very introverted when it comes to them expressing themselves somebody here may uh, may have to delay a trip or some sort of travel okay to focus on themselves this could be a divine masculine somebody could be like taking a break or a breather on traveling towards you but there is some sort of like ideal about bringing compromise to get back together to make it work. Somebody's trying to change for you or you for them. Somebody no longer wants to be a false twin flame or uh, known as this or a part of a false dynamic. They want something that's real. And that's why they're they're holding themselves back so that they can uh, go through the dark night of the soul or this, um, yeah. Somebody is jealous of being rejected or, or jealous of a person. Somebody is jealous that a person may be rejected. Somebody is upset that they may not be what this person needs anymore. Maybe used to, but not anymore. Yep, somebody learned a lesson from being in a karmic situation or dynamic. Somebody's cool on this water sign here. Somebody's going to be finding their life partner, but not ready to give their all to a person or a uh, an air sign. This could be for a divine feminine. Yeah, somebody needs time to face their fears and deal with the old wounds so that they can come in at the right time to make things solidified here, okay? Somebody doesn't have access to you telepathically. 
somebody's blocked off. I can't make this up. Okay. Somebody still needs to keep their distance until they're ready to, you know, get into this divine energy as the masculine and or feminine. Message for the Virgo. Okay, so somebody lacks a sense of humor when it comes to lightening the mood so that they won't have to grieve anything from the past. Somebody's building up their self-esteem to attain relationships that will give them like a, a heightened energy of happiness. Somebody's facing adversity in their fears. Somebody here isn't alone when it comes to love. I feel like when it comes to love, it's like you found a purpose to love or somebody to love here. Anyway, that's what I have here for your current messages. Hopefully it resonates. If it does, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Also, if you're interested in your own personal love reading, be sure to email me. And as always, stay blessed. And I'll see you guys in the next one.